WooCommerce Multilingual and Multicurrency is a WordPress plugin that allows you to translate your WooCommerce store. You can download it for free from WordPress.org or if you have a WPML account, get it from the WPML downloads page. And if you use it together with WPML, besides adding multi-currency, you can translate your whole site including products, product categories, reviews, checkout pages, store emails, and more. Let me quickly show you how to use the free standalone version to add multi-currency to your store. Go to WPML.org for complete information about using the full version together with WPML. You install WooCommerce Multilingual and Multicurrency plugin just like any other. You can search for it from the plugins Add New Page or upload it to your site manually, which is what I've done in this example. When ready, click to activate it. That's it! You can now go to WooCommerce, WooCommerce Multilingual and Multicurrency and start using the new features. To start, enable the multi-currency mode. In the free standalone version, you can show currencies to users based on their location. To show currencies based on site language, you'll have to get WPML and translate your store. After selecting the client location option, you have to enter a MaxMind license key. MaxMind is a service that allows WooCommerce to get the geolocation of the current user. You can easily generate this key for free by following the instructions on the link here. Once you enter the key, you can proceed to add secondary currencies to your WooCommerce store. It's really easy. Just click the Add Currency button, select the currency you want to add, and then its other options. First, you can set an exchange rate between this currency and your store's main one. WooCommerce Multilingual and Multicurrency also allows you to set up automatic exchange rates, which I'll show you how to do in a minute. If you want to use automatic exchange rates, just leave the option as is. Next, you can see how the currency will look like on your store's front end. Click the pen icon to edit this. As you can see, there's a number of settings you can tweak, so the currency is presented exactly as you want. In my case, I'll put the euro sign to the right. And last but not least, you can select the countries for which to display this currency. OK, when done, click Save. You just added an additional currency to your site. Let's check the front end. Here's a single product and it now features a currency switcher. As we switch to another currency, the price adjusts automatically. Nice! Now let's set up automatic exchange rates for your currencies. As exchange rates fluctuate on a daily basis, this feature is extremely handy. Simply click to enable automatic exchange rates and you can select from four popular services. As with all similar services, you need to register and get an API key that you enter here. There's a link next to each service, which takes you to the relevant page to get started. Please note that the basic options are usually free, but there's a limited number of daily and monthly requests your site can make, so look into the best plans for your store. Enter your API key and then select if you'd like to add the lifting charge and how frequently the exchange rate should be updated. When you're done, click to save the changes. You can now see a precise, automatic exchange rate in the table of your currencies. And that's it! The last few options on this multi-currency settings page are about customizing your currency switcher. You can change the order of currencies, add custom styling using CSS and more. Besides setting exchange rates for all the products in your store, WooCommerce Multilingual and Multicurrency allows you to manually set prices in other currencies for any individual product. Just edit any product, turn on the option to set prices in other currencies manually and enter the prices. It's as easy as that. Finally, once you have multiple currencies set up on your store, you can check sales analytics per currency. On the Analytics page, simply select the currency you want to see the data for. And that's it! We just added full multi-currency features to our WooCommerce store. And if you want to translate your whole store, go to WPML.org and get the WPML plugin for the complete set of features.